chance, okay? Let me get back to work. Brian, this is gonna be. Don't leave your motorcycle hanging out like that. Nero soldier and researcher wear a special hazmat set. Okay. Follow O'Brien. Am I hiding right now? Yeah, I'm hiding. Lieutenant O'Brien. Follow this jerk ass. He knows where my wife is. Oh shit, oh shit. and slowly Son of a bitch, at least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. Now, what did that been something? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, what do you want? Stay back. I just want just to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that, that if conducting operations in quarantine zones, if I encounter any civilians or sub... sub drip, Civilians that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next night, uh, refugee Nero camp, protocol two the chapters seven were states. burning, I, everyone was dead, two they were slaughtered, seven. torn limb Nero, for goddamn limb. Alright, listen up, we're gonna do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell is you're doing out here. The hard way. I crack open that little space suit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? <laughs> Yes. Okay. Okay. You remember the rooftop of the old brewery. I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember. A, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead. So I'm going to ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another oh. camp. Like you said, the camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You have one of our radios. That's how you... 
I, I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll check. Uh huh. And I'm gonna go with you. No, you, you can't. Please, you don't. Hey, you don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look. If you're gonna fucking kill me, do it. Okay? I did my job. Did the woman, your wife? I put her on oxygen. I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic. She wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life. O'Brien, report. I have to go. Please, I, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you, I don't care how long it takes. I'm going to track you down. And I'm going to do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. All right, so at least we got some information. How you doing, kid? They won't let me leave. Why would you want to leave? It's safe here. I have to work. Okay. God damn it. Gift shop. Gotta be one in here somewhere. Oh, these are the Ripper territory, huh? <laughs> That's not bueno. <laughs> Nothing like scrap. My dog, this is Ripper territory. Let's be careful. Lisa, I go away. Brush you some. It's beautiful. Will you take me with you? Take me back to Marion Forks. I can't, because it's not safe. I gotta turn in. They make us get up really early for work. Hey, uh, you're not answering the radio. Yep. I know, I was... Well, hold on, hold on. No, I'm all right, I'm all right. Trying to get clear, you know? You're burning up. Ugh, my head's pounding like a mother. You're burning up. No, 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 I'm just, I'm just tired. Okay, stay here, rest. I'll think of something. Look, I don't need a goddamn babysitter, I'm fine. Shit, come on, come on, come on, come on, think. Oh, story time. Here, come here, I'll show you what you're looking for. Uh. Yep, found it. <laughs> All right, come on, focus. I am focused. All right, so this one is called Lavandula angustifolia. Lavender? Yes, well, I'm still paying off my student loan, so I will stick with Latin, mm -hmm. but you can call it that. Yeah, get your money's worth. Go for it. <laughs> okay, come on, give me your hand. All right, so you want to put one hand around the flower. All right. And then put the other hand at the stem. Okay. Just like that, and then you pull nice and slow. Yeah, I pulled weeds before. Excuse me, sir, this is not a weed. You have to be gentle. But apply pressure. Oh, yeah, but not too hard. <laughs> yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There you go. That's perfect. <laughs> and it doesn't smell very good. Okay, you hold on to those, and I'm going to collect more. <laughs> so, uh, why lavender? Well, the guys at the lab are pretty excited. They, they think they have this subspecies, which might have mutated monoterpenoids, which produce a modified linalool that... That is so... Oh, my... Thank you, Einstein. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. It, 
it has a chemical that we can use to synthesize a new medicine for burn patients. Oh. Where I'm from, the only weed used for medicine is the kind that you smoke. You know, Boozer knows a guy with a farm that's about three miles up the road. Oh, that's great. Boozer's gonna wind up in prison and take you with him. <laughs> so what else do you guys make? Like chemical weapons, WMDs, shit like that? No, 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 no. Well, at least not me. Yeah? It's in my contract. None of my research can be used for military purposes. You missed one earlier. More over here. Wait, stop. Oh, come on, the weather's yeah. gonna be great. Hold, hold on, hold on. What's wrong? Well, I, I didn't mean stop that. <laughs> come on, what is it? It's a long story. Well, it's okay. Oh, don't tell me he's afraid of water. I like walking. <laughs> so, why don't you tell me about your plants? Really? Okay. Well, this particular genus is adventitious. You want me to ask? It means not native to this area. You can thank Ogden for that. Who? Oh, shit, I asked. Peter Skeen Ogden, first explorer to come through this part of Oregon. He and some of the other early explorers brought all their medicinal herbs and plants with them. Some got away, and now they're growing here. Mostly mm. along the shores of small lakes and ponds. First white explorer? Wow, look at you, being all politically correct. Don't buy into all the biker stereotypes you see on TV. We are actually quite charming. I bet. The MC's got a couple of brothers, one fully patched. I don't think I've seen one person of color since I arrived in your strange little backwater paradise. Yeah, Jack actually had some guys bust in from Sacramento just to piss off our skinhead rivals. He did not. <laughs> No, he did not. I'm kidding. Jersey Jim's an old buddy of mine. Patched him and myself. We served in the same unit. Come by the clubhouse Sunday. I'll show you around. You like the guy. He's funny as shit. He makes a mean margarita. Well, I have to be in the lab early on Monday, so... I'll have us back in your bed by 10. I promise. How can I refuse an offer like that? <sighs> okay, you try picking some now. Lavender. You, you want me to pick lavender? Yep. And bring me three plants, and don't crush them. Oh, I'm gonna crush them. <laughs> Come on. Uh, got one. Good for you. This one? Yep, keep going. <laughs> he tells... Last one. Great, bring him she, here. She taught you how to just pull them out, and he still uses a knife to chop them off. <sighs> oh. <laughs> for you. Tree is alive and farewell after all. No, oh, if he's <laughs> not, then I didn't kill him. <laughs> hey, oh, oh, oh. Aww, poor guys. Hey, is that the one we're gonna smoke later? No, but this is the one we're gonna drink. I make this killer herbal tea with it. I'll bet. <laughs> <laughs> hey, all right, if you come over, then I will make it for you as long as you give me a ride home. All right, great. You're gonna be a believer. And we'll grab a beer from myself on the way over. <laughs> Of course, once again, it's going to do that shit again, huh? Took care of a couple of them. Bounty. Uh... 
And do I have enough bandages? Craft. He just randomly died of a heart attack. Don't worry about it. Nice and slowly. Right in the neck. You think you can ambush me and get away with it? Oh. I could probably bring the horde over here. Holy shish kebab.
Whew. All right. That does not go as planned, but okay. Rile them real good. Come on, stragglers. Hey, Boozer. Uh, God damn it! Uh, it's a funny thing. I, I was remembering how uh, a few summers back, Sarah took me out to Bear Creek. To, we were picking lavender, and uh, she Listen. taught <laughs> she taught me how to make this sap for Burns. And uh, look, I got out today. Okay? I actually had to look around the mound. I cleared some traps. The arm's almost as good as new. All right. Okay. I'm just gonna leave it right here. Hey, hey, just give me a couple days, okay? Just right up north like you said and get out of this shithole. Sure. Yeah. It's always a couple of days.